Namaste and welcome to a yoga class for complete beginners presented by yoga-vidya.de Lie down on your back for relaxation and for nakarasana exercises for lengthening your lower spine and for releasing tensions from your back. Your legs apart, arms to your side, palms facing the ceiling. Breathe a few times deeply. When you inhale, abdomen goes up. When you exhale, abdomen goes down. You can also put one hand on your navel and then inhale, abdomen rises, exhale, abdomen goes down, inhale, abdomen rises, exhale, abdomen goes down. Breathe very deeply. When you exhale, feel that you relax. When you inhale, feel that you get new energy. Exhale, release. Inhale new strength and energy. Feel that rising and falling of your abdomen. Feel that relaxation and new energy. Now put your legs together. Your legs remain straight, but your heels are touching. Now bend your right knee and grasp hold of your knee with both hands. Keep your head on the floor and with both hands grasp hold of your knee and pull your knee into your chest. Hold your leg steadily and you can also try to pull your knee more towards the center of your chest. And now inhale and exhale deeply. When you inhale your abdomen pushes against the thigh, thus lengthening your lower spine. The helps to stretch your buttocks and also your lower spine. Very good for your discs. Now lower your foot and stretch out your leg on the floor. And now feel how your legs are feeling. You might feel that your right leg is now longer than your left leg. When you stretch, then your muscles can relax. When muscles relax, prana, the energies can flow. And then you feel longer. Now bend your other knee, bend your left knee. Grasp hold of your knee with both hands and pull your knee towards your chest. Breathe deeply. And when you inhale, push your abdomen towards your thigh. When you exhale, you can feel that you can stretch a little further. Again, make sure you pull your knee towards the middle of your chest, towards the chest bone. Inhale towards your thigh, thus lengthening your lower spine, releasing tension from your vertebras. Also a very good exercise for your abdominal organs, very good for your digestion. Slowly release your leg, put your foot on the floor and stretch out your leg and again feel the length of your legs. Feel especially also how your lower spine feels longer and your lower back feels relaxed. Again, put both feet together. Legs remain straight, but both feet together. Bend your right knee. And now put your right knee to the left. Put your left hand on your right knee and look towards the right. You might even feel some or hear some cracking noise in your lower spine. That's a good sign. Do it gently and feel that gentle stretch in your lower spine.
You can also feel the stretch in your thigh and in your buttocks, but especially try to feel how this exercise lengthens the sides of your muscles next to your lower spine. Deep breathing is very helpful. Again, inhale, put your knee up and exhale, lower your foot and stretch out your leg. Now feel the floor underneath you. You might even feel that your right side is deeper than your left. Stretching releases tension, relaxation lets energy flow. And when energy is flowing, you feel larger, wider. Close both legs. Bend your other knee, bend your left knee, grasp hold of your knee first, pull your knee a little bit towards you. And then put your left knee to the right. Your right hand is on top of your knee and your left arm is to the left and you look towards the left. Your right knee can touch the floor, but it doesn't have to touch the floor. Do it as it's comfortable. And then feel the stretch in your buttock while you breathe deeply. Feel the gentle stretch also in your lower spine and in your lumbar muscles. And release tension with each exhalation and widening more with each inhalation. Again, lift up your knee, lower your foot, and stretch out your leg, legs apart, palms facing the ceiling, and breathe deeply. Again, feel the floor underneath you, feel the floor supporting you, and you might feel energy flow in your lower back, buttocks, and upper back. And you can feel how your abdomen moves gently when you inhale and exhale. Slowly put both feet together. Bend one knee. Grasp hold of your knee and sit up using your knee to get up and then stand up for some neck exercises. You stand with your feet a little bit apart. Feet can gently show towards the outside. Main weight is on your heels, but all ten toes touch the floor. Your arms hang down quite relaxed. And you can smile gently. Now pull up your shoulders towards your ears and feel the contraction of your shoulders. Slowly lower your shoulders, gently feel how the shoulders relax and feel how the shoulders are relaxed. Again Gently pull up the shoulders. You can keep your head in the center and feel the contraction of your shoulders. And gently lower your shoulders. Feel the shoulders relax and feel how the shoulders are relaxed. Now pull your shoulder blades backwards. Feel the upper back muscles work. Feel those muscles. Gently release and feel how the upper back muscles relax and are relaxed. One more time. Pull the shoulders backwards. Feel that contraction. And gently feel the shoulders relax. And feel how the upper back feels completely relaxed. 
Feel how the whole area of your upper back, your neck, your shoulders are relaxed and alive. Now feel in your hands, palms, fingertips. You might feel some tingling sensation or some warmth, or you might feel as if energy flows through your fingers. Yogis call that prana, life force. If you do exercises for shoulders and neck, then the life force can flow. Now gently sit down on the floor for some forward bend. You can stretch out your right leg and you can keep your left leg bent. If you want, you can also put a pillow under your left knee so it's comfortable for your left knee. You can also put your left foot next to your knee instead of next to your thigh. Then grasp hold either of your knee or of your calf muscle or of your foot. Go as far as you gently can, keeping your back straight and your head up. Breathe very deeply. Feel the gentle stretch in the back of your leg. Remember, go only as far as comfortable. Breathe deeply. And with each inhalation you lengthen your spine and with each exhalation you relax more. With the next inhalation slowly sit up again. And stretch out your left leg. Bend your right knee a little bit. Grasp hold of your left thigh, knee, calf or foot. Go as far as you can comfortably. Keep your back straight, head up. If you're more flexible, you can also lower further. If you're less flexible, go as far as you comfortably can. Make sure your back feels comfortable, your neck feels comfortable. Meaning, keep your neck and your back as high up as necessary. You can feel the stretch in the back of your leg. And with each inhalation you lengthen your spine. With each exhalation you can go a little further, gently. Breathe deeply. Now slowly with next inhalation sit up again. Gently stretch out both legs. Now we do an exercise for strengthening your lower back. A variation of the inclined plane. Put your elbows on the floor behind you. Your lower arms are touching. Now lift up your hips, keeping your head up. Breathe deeply. That is quite demanding for your lower back. You strengthen your back muscles quite strongly. Slowly lower your buttocks. Breathe once or twice. And just one more time, lift up your buttocks again. If it's comfortable for your head, you can also lower your head. Otherwise, keep your head up. And slowly lower your buttocks and put your hands again on the floor sitting up straight with your legs straight. Now keep your right leg right arm behind you and put your left hand to the right of your right knee. To the left hand to the right of your right knee while both legs remain straight. And then you twist towards the right. Breathe deeply. 
depending on the length of your arm, you can either keep your hand on the floor or most will put the hand on their knee. Gently feel that twist in your back, very good for your muscles. Slowly twist towards the other side. Put the left hand behind you and the right hand to the left of your left knee and twist towards the left. Breathe deeply. Feel that gentle twisting in your back. And slowly come back to the center. Lie down on your back and relax for deep relaxation of three minutes. Lift up your right leg a few inches, contract your leg and drop. Lift up your left leg a few inches, drop. Lift up your hips a few inches, contract your lower back and your buttocks, relax. Lift up your arms a few inches, make fists with your hands, relax. Pull your shoulders towards your ears, relax. Turn your head from side to side. Back to the center. Now make sure you're in a comfortable position, legs apart, palms facing the ceiling, shoulders away from your ears, neck is long. Put your awareness into your legs, feel and repeat mentally, my legs relax. Feel your hands, arms and shoulders. Feel or repeat mentally, my arms relax. Feel your buttocks, lower back and upper back. Feel and repeat, my back is relaxing, completely relaxed. Feel my abdomen and chest are relaxed. Shoulders, neck and face relax. The whole body is completely relaxed. Mind relaxed. Enjoy that relaxation for a few moments, enjoy that wonderful feeling of complete relaxation. Now breathe a few times deeply and repeat mentally, I'm full of energy, I'm full of joy, I look forward to a wonderful evening, a wonderful day. Now move your feet, move your hands, stretch out your arms behind your head, stretch out your whole body, then bend your knee, Grasp hold of your knee and sit up. Ready for a wonderful day or for a wonderful evening. All the best. I wish you peace, joy and happiness. More information about yoga you can see on our internet pages yoga-vidya.org slash English. More also on our video pages.